so I've not done a book a book design in a while but I wanted to create a book from scratch on Canva most of the book the book covers that I design I use either Illustrator or Photoshop just because it's easy to get the, the dimensions correct and um, I'm able to drag the template the, 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 the guide from from off my desktop onto onto um, where is it the Amazon template I'm able to drag it onto onto Photoshop and then it works out perfectly you do have persons who create their book covers in in um, in Canva here and we want to show that we are going to design a beautiful book cover and um, drag some information on it and we want it to be eye-catching first thing we're going to be doing is we're going to be looking for some elements and the elements that we want to use we'd like to create something with a kind of a look of tear like the page of the paper the paper is tear is ripped and um, I like to use the free stuff I like to use the free stuff because they are free let's just um, call it the background for now just so that we can see where everything falls the next thing we also want to do the spine I was I made an estimation that the page size for this book is going to be 200 pages 400 pages and therefore the calculator states that it has to be uh, 21.7 millimeters so I through this box let's just get this and have it in the middle okay um, so this is this is drawn to scale and we're really trying to get this to be okay with the Amazon I'm gonna change the color so that it stands out and this is the, 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 the these are not the colors I'm gonna be working with at all but let's just have some lineup the next one i want is this i'm not able to change the color of this so let's get rid of that um where did i get the other one um let's see more like this see more like this and i want it to be free No? Magic recommendations? What is that? Um, I don't know. A few more like this. Alright, I'm just gonna... Let's just duplicate this page. Just so that I don't give away my design before it is done. But I'll be able to drag stuff from one side to the next because... I really want to keep this video short so that I can get to the next one. Um, well, so let's just copy this. Undo. So we go here, and then copy, and come here, and say paste. All right. This this is the this is the, this is what we're gonna have. So the most important thing of a book is going to be the book. Uh, title the book title let's just position this back behind all of that so it's not shown um, uh, let's change this book this cover to, to blue or a backdrop kind of so let's get some shape on this thing elements as long as the finish item looks good you should be fine so let's just drop 
drag this here drag this here because this color I want to be this and this I want to be um, this color looking nice All right this is overlay this is overlay this is the background and this need to come back down a little bit um, we could make the spine black as well we could make the spine black but then do we want to put an okay so let's just get the the, the title of the book on here we go go copy because I've already created that and we're gonna make it a heading we're gonna put it here and I'm gonna say paste no no paste okay not working let's go copy it will work <coughs> and then we want a fun style now I like this just 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 for now just for now I'm not sure if that's what I'm gonna where it's gonna end up at this is what I'm gonna end up using I don't know but I'm liking it right and we're saying natural here Before we get to putting on anything on here, I kind of want to do a drop, a drop shadow. We're going to change the color so we know which one is at the front and which one is at the back. And let's choose a dark shade. And then we're going to say position this backward. Right? We want to create a uh kind of a, a different a, 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 some kind of depth and then we can go right here and lower the opacity and then it looks real good we can do the same thing here we're gonna drag this forward we're going to change the color to white I think I should change it to gray and the darker gray. I'm not sure why it's not changing. Good. And then we're going to position this backward. All right. And the, the real trick in this, the, not the trick, but the, the, the part that makes it really work is when you just lower the opacity on the thing, lower it way down. And it just pop right it like it's supposed to. If I if I make it black, it does add a depth. I could use black. Look dazzling a bit though. But I think I want to carry that down just smidge. Just smidge. Um everything have to be so pronounced. No, it's giving the that were just a little bit of you know just a little bit of jazz or um, depth makes it look like here is, is 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 sunken and then let's get our or the image that we're gonna be using oh, this is part of a design I need to get rid of these it belong to a client I did her book and I need to so we're going to use this picture. This is another picture we got off the internet just for the tutorial. Not for sale, not for anything other than um, to use here. So let's make it a little bit smaller. What am I moving? What am I moving? This. this. A little bit smaller position her nicely and then we're just gonna say position backward 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 right 
we want this to go backward. All right, so now, now we have, all right, let's just lock up stuff so that we don't destroy them, right? Um, um, undo, undo, okay. If I do this, I should get both of them. And we want them to be here. All right? And if I do this, I want both of them to go backwards. Backwards. Okay. And then I am thinking of okay. letting her just fill up the page. And let her face just smile. Her hair is all over there. And this is what I envision. Good thing is all of those things are behind. So let's just let's just get some text onto here and um, bring it over to here and say paste. And that's what we're saying. I've already designed the book, um, playing around with the idea of different changes that I'd like to make. But let's see what happens. So we're going to say copy. Believe you me, this designing this takes absolutely. Um, <clears throat> not a lot of time, depending on what you're comfort, comfortable with. So, um, let's just copy some more stuff. We've been, we've been doing a bit of work around here and I don't want to be doing it all over again, just so that you see the, and then we say copy, come back here and say paste. And everything will just paste right there. Cause that's what we want. Move it away from the edge of the book and do that. And in no time, this is a, a book cover design. Sometimes it's not speed, sometimes it's what you want to create, where the, what are the information that you have to put on the back of the book. There's so many things I could do with this. For example, I might want to do. Um, I drop shadow on this or I let's see if we effect and let's see if we want it to curve the hair but we could curve it the other way out natural hair put it that way hmm? how would that look Or here, we really want her here not to be. Um, okay, let's pull her down a little bit because I already want the hair to fall back. The name, the t the title, to fall in the background. Natural hair, um, because the idea is for you to see her here more than you see anything else the book is about natural hair so um these are the guides and these guides uh if you're gonna show it on social media once it is centered it once it's past these lines it's you lose it you lose the information um what is this guide for wasn't this the center of the book all right, let's see. Let's drag it off and let's find the center of the entire thing. Um, two, 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 two. All right. I don't know anymore. I don't know anymore. The center of the book should have been here. The two. 
that should have been but anyway let's turn off these guides turn off the ruler and turn off the guide so that you can see the design a little bit clearer the good thing is that you can change the color uh, the hair is out I like this okay this is the one I created before in a jiffy and notice how her head is saying different direction because I could have just flipped